Hey, uh, Adamant Deck Tech here. Right here, I've got a frozen turn down base. So basically, that bit's stuck to the ring, the adjustable ring. Uh, so, what I've done is I've applied some WD 40 top and bottom to the threads, some penetrating oil, anything like that. What I'm going to do is try some heat on the inside to free that grease off. If you turn the bezel anti-clockwise that locks that should undo if you go clockwise that bit undoes from that so you want to go anti-clockwise and now I'm going to try heat this bit up here and hopefully <coughs> it should free off I'm using a heat gun so I can direct the heat directly onto the piece that I want to warm up And uh, whilst I'm doing this and getting it up to temperature, if you want to check out any of my other videos, plenty of tutorials, or check out my Facebook page, see stuff that I've done, or even if you're not confident doing your decks yourself and want to send them to someone or bring them to me or whatever, there's loads of options. You can have LED changers, cable changers, upgrades, wraps, powder coating, painting decals the list is endless so what I'm doing now is I'm heating the threads up where the grease is and hopefully the heat will melt the grease combined with a WD-40 should free it off hopefully I'll give that a go see if it needs any more heat Oh, here it comes, look. So now, as I'm pulling that round, it's moving and it's freeing off. So now it's free. That's free from there. Uh, you see all the crap and gunk that's built up over the years. So now I need to take that out as well before it cools down. So why is that'll be seized in? So what you can do is, what I'll do is I'll just clean these threads off so they don't get stuck again. There's a bit of isopropylene, rubbing alcohol, and a wire brush. I'll just clean the threads out. Once they've cleaned, you don't have to be fully clean because you're going to give it a good clean anyway. But it's just to stop it sticking back in there. Get a bit of the white. See how clean they've come. So what, now, what I'm going to do now is screw it back in there. It doesn't matter about calibrating it or lining it up where it should be. Just get it so it screws on. Which is there. And I'm going to go clockwise. As I go clockwise, it should free that other ring off. It might need heating up again. As it's cooled down, the grease has got thick again. What I'll do is I'll heat that ring up. You don't have to put a lot of heat in, just enough to free the grease off. Nice even up. See that's locked in now. The same again. Same as you did first time, bit of WD 40. Plenty of heat. I've got my heat gun set at 300. I don't want it too hot because that plastic ring with the numbers on can come loose from the bezel.
and hopefully it should come free and still be able to separate both parts. There we go, that's freed that off. So now I need to free that from there, which it will do. So if I hold the ring, turn that, that comes undone. I'll take that bit out and now turn that clockwise and that one will come undone as well. Hopefully. Ah, 